According to the World Health Organization, there are over 153 million people that are uh, visually impaired. The problem is actually getting an eye prescription. Eye prescription is normally a lengthy process that is done manually, subjectively, and uh, an optometrist must do it. In Western countries, there is one optometrist every 5,000 people. In rural India, there is one every 250,000 people. Uh, handling all these large populations requires using something that is fast and something that can be operated by a non-specialist. Inside Science. Wavefront abrometers have proved in labs and in clinics to be very accurate in obtaining a prescription. However, these abrometers are generally expensive, are generally large, and therefore not very well suited for this purpose. We actually, in collaboration with a group at, at MIT, took this challenge and converted these large instruments from the lab into a small unit. And the first units are actually being manufactured in our labs in, in Madurai, India. We're talking right now about hundreds and thousands of units, really low cost, handheld, and that can be built for a fraction of the cost of these lab or clinic collaborators. It's very easy to operate. Non-optometrists are, are using it because it's objective, doesn't require any prior skill to operate, and, and can give you a prescription in, in seconds. Clinical studies that have been conducted demonstrate that the accurate prescriptions are, are obtained very similar to those obtained from the standard subjective procedures or expensive autorefractometers. The people wearing the eye prescriptions obtained by the QuickC, which is the name of the instrument, are actually given 2020 or, or, or more. So they're very accurately getting the, the refraction that needs to be put in their spectacles. This will not replace an optometrist, but it might be a good help for an optometrist in the developed world to actually be used in the clinic as an initial prescription or to speed up their practice. So the step is now going into the hands of eye centers and, and vision clinics out in the field. The instrument is now being deployed and now it's getting in hands to those that will benefit from these eye prescriptions and, and get spectacles. Inside Science. If you enjoyed this edition, follow us on the web and social media. Powered by the American Institute of Physics and a coalition of underwriters.